everybody! Today I will be talking about my Angelic Pretty Paris haul. A couple of weeks I went to Paris and my previous video was about the Angelic Pretty Tea Party. So now I will show you the things I got and bought. So without further ado, let's just start! I will be like going backwards, so I will start at a tea party and then the things I bought beforehand. So I have the biggest and most exciting items at the end to keep it all exciting. So first let me start with my Angelic Pretty Anniversary Tea Party ticket. It's a very lovely ticket that looks like a frame with poodles in it and an Eiffel Tower and first anniversary tea party at the front and at the back it has my number which was 29 and the date and the location and some notes. I think this is a really nice invitation and I think I will put it up on my wall. We received two very lovely presents at the tea party, the first being this amazing face towel. It has Angelic Pretty on it and a lot of amazing pastries, so that's very fitting for the theme. We also received this pouch and mirror. Now I have to be honest, I was hoping the mirror was actually a batch because I really love batches. However, it is a mirror which is also really nice, but I might turn it into a batch eventually. The mirror has a poodle at the front which is really nice because I really like dogs. And it has Paris 2017 on it and a lovely pink pouch to put it in. Pouches always come in handy so I'm very happy with this. Then I was very very lucky to win something in the raffle, which is this absolutely amazing blouse. I really didn't expect to win something, so I was very happy when my number 29 was called. It has a really pretty pink color and it has stripes and a lot of golden accents and details and absolutely stunning buttons. However, sadly this blouse doesn't have shearing, so I'm not sure if I will ever fit it. So I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with it, but I'm sure I'll find something. Lucky for me, the blouse also came with this amazing rose beretta. It doesn't match the color of the blouse at all, but I don't really mind. This is one of those clips I've really always wanted because I love them so much, but I somehow never bought them. So getting one in the raffle is just absolutely amazing. It is a beautiful hair clip with three roses on it, a dangly pearl chain and a crystal hanging from it and some lovely ribbons attached. I am really, really happy with this item. So those were the items I got at the Angelic Pretty Tea Party. I also have a mini haul that has nothing to do with Angelic Pretty, but I'm sure you will forgive me. First of all, I got this lovely keychain. I really like keychains. Somehow I always end up with one when I'm on holiday. And this one has an Eiffel Tower and a macaron on it. This is basically a metaphor for me in Paris. I also found this amazing magazine in a bookshop. I never expected to find anything like this in Europe. It is a Takarazuka magazine and it has one of the actresses on the front and I'm so psyched about this magazine. I I don't even know what to say. It's I'm really happy with this. I also got these two lovely rings at the shop where I also bought the dress for my final exam. I will not show you the dress, however the rings are about as sparkly as my dress is, so it gives you quite an indication of what it looks like. One of the rings is a red heart surrounded by white crystals and the other one is a kind of star-shaped white crystal ring. They're really really nice and I'm sure I'll find a way to incorporate these into my outfit. So now on to the things I bought at the Angelic Pretty Shop. During the days before the tea party a lot of amazing sets and surprises were released at the shop. However, I only got there on Friday late afternoon so I missed the things on Thursday and Friday morning. Which is not that bad because there were a lot of amazing things waiting for me anyway. So I went shopping on Saturday morning. I was one of the first at the shop which meant I was one of the first people who could choose from the special sets that were released and I will show you what I got. First of all, I got this lovely... <laughs> First of all, I got this lovely clear file. I don't know what's up with me and clear files. I rarely use them, however, I still buy them, so maybe I should start using them. This one is from the Bridges Crown series. It has all these amazing crowns on it and a ribbon with Angelic Pretty on it. And right now it has a paper inside of it, so usually it is actually see-through, which is really cool, I think. Also, for the first time in my Lolita life, I got a Lucky Pack! There were some lovely Lucky Packs released, and on Saturday it was an accessories Lucky Pack, and I got one, finally! I couldn't scratch this off my bucket list because I wanted this for so long. So I got some really lovely items. Like to be honest, at first I didn't really ca even care about the contents because just the fact I had a lucky pack just made me so happy already. But then I got kind of curious to see what I got so 
I ended up opening it anyway. First of all, I got this set of wrist cuffs. I was looking for a pair of pink wrist cuffs anyway, so this is really lucky for me. They have lovely star lace and dotted lace with AP on it, stripes, and at the front they have a bow with a star on it. These are really nice and I'm sure I will use these very soon. I also got this lovely bow with a daisy on it. I mean, do I really need to say anything about this? It's just really nice, really cute. There's a pink bow with gingham print, a white bow and a little daisy in the front. I love it so much, it's so cute. I also got this amazing other bow that absolutely does not match anything in my wardrobe, but I really like it anyway because it has this kind of classy feel to it. It's a sort of beige-ish bow with lovely gold details and I am sure I will find some way to use it because it's really, really nice actually. And finally, this lovely shell set. Initially I didn't really like this accessory series, but up close it's actually really nice. Especially the necklace because it has dangling starfish and shells. And I generally just really like shells, so this is really nice. Okay, so now for the big thing. They had some really lovely special sets during the week and uh, I missed out on the ones on Thursday and Friday, but that's okay because the one dress I really really wanted was released on Saturday and I got it and I'm really happy about it. So the dress I got is this lovely Harlequinade special set dress. I really wanted this dress only in pink and sex and I'm very lucky I got it. I'm really happy with it. This is one of those dresses I've been admiring for a long time but never bought. So getting it as a special set is just really really lucky and I'm very happy about that. It came with this matching bow I am wearing which is really cute and very versatile. The dress has a card and masquerade theme. There's a horse on it with it wearing a mask. Uh, dancing girl wearing a mask and some rabbits wearing masks. It has a lot of diamond shapes and very lovely lace. And the bow in front has a bit of a lavender color, which is very, very lovely. I've always wanted a pink and light blue dress, so I'm very, very happy with this one. I also played shopping service for a girl in my community that day, so I went home with two dresses and of course sent hers to her. But because I spent over a certain amount of money, I got a novelty. And to be honest, it's the best novelty of all because I got this amazing pink angelic pretty jewelry box. It's quite a simple box that has a mirror on the inside. Hi and a compartment and a compartment underneath that where you can put in your jewelry and it has Angelic Pretty on the front. So yeah, that was my Angelic Pretty Paris haul. I hope you like my items, I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time. Bye bye!